When you play golf, every shot you hit surely doesn't go down the middle of the fairway or right on the green. Sometimes you wind up in a tough situation. I'm over a little short par fours green right here. Too much club has put me up against a tree and for a right hander, I'm pretty much toast. So I've got a couple of different options and obviously the safe option is I'm just gonna take my little sand wedge right here and hit a nice little soft chip shot away from the tree, giving me a normal little shot to play back toward the green and basically give myself one extra shot to play on the hole. But a lot of people, and I'm certainly one of them, just not gonna go down that easy. So I'm gonna show you three different shots that you can play and get this ball on the green from here. And the first one is quite obvious, it would be just playing this shot left-handed. So when you're playing a left-handed shot, you wanna take a club with at least eight iron loft, I've got a sand wedge that I would have played this shot right-handed with. Turn the club upside down, take the grip left-handed, and then make a couple practice swings to get used to this swing that's not your normal mode of operation, and also how hard you're gonna hit the ball. Because you don't wanna hit this shot solid, have it go right at the hole, hit it too far, too short, and then walk over there and hit the shot. Usable shot on the green, 15, 20 feet away, a lot better than playing from right here. Now, you might want to get a little cuter. And to me, for some people, an easier shot is the backhand shot. Just take the club in your hand, your right hand, normal way, normal position, and then just turn the club to face the target. And you can look over your shoulder and get an idea of how hard you want to do the backhand swing. And then walk over there, get the ball just about even with your toes. Make sure you're lined up correctly, and then hit it on the green. Another 15, 20 feet away, no problem. So the third shot might be the most esoteric, but it might be the one that saves you an important shot at the right time. Everybody's seen Sam Snead's side saddle putting stroke where the left hand is on top of the grip and the right hand is turned like you're pitching a penny or throwing a ball underhanded. Well, it's that same motion standing to the normal side of the ball for a right-hander, except I think to play a shot of 20 or 30 yards, you need a little more leverage, so you want to turn your right hand upside down. About half of the hand on the grip, half of the hand on the metal, and you make this little motion right here. That allows me to play a shot from the normal side of the ball, looking at the target. I can line it up really good. I can make a couple practice swings to see your angle of attack. Look at the hole one more time to get the reference in your head of how hard you want to hit it, and then try for a solid strike. You'll be surprised that with just a little bit of practice, these three trick shots will give you options you haven't had before when faced with an obstacle blocking your right hand swing. When all your friends are playing safe and having to chip out, you might be able to save par or save a great round from going bad. Remember, practice it away from the course and maybe casually on the course before you try it under pressure. But if you do, I guarantee you, you'll be happy with the results.